A very controlled, very durable, but the weapon has not been there. Do you think the weapon's gonna be able to hold up here in the finals and pull out the victory? I think the weapon is gonna hold up. It really only needs to deliver two five, good hits, four, I'd say. Three, I just don't five, know if it's gonna be able to get uh, five, the delivery five, that it needs. Five, here we go, out of the box. Both taking it slow, spinning up. Oh, the Mirage weapon is down spinning up. on Mirage. Phenomenon spinning up. Yeah, that... That said, despite Phenomenon's big hit to the front of Mirage, Mirage is showing no signs of stopping. Mirage is so heavy, so big. Phenomenon needs to build up the speed on these hits to be able to deliver any sort of inertia and get that tip it's after. Otherwise, it's just going to be shooting sparks off the front. Really incredible how well Mirage is able to face its opponent despite its, its size and its drive style. Decent hit there, but still unable to get Mirage flipped over. Now, you see on the front of Mirage, there is a... Uh, oh, oh, and there it is. That is the moment Phenomenon was looking for. Mirage. Mirage. Whoa. Mirage can run upside down like this, but if it gets tipped just a little more onto the front, it will be stuck. That's what Brandon's going to be looking to do, and there it is. Big pieces missing, but it doesn't really matter. The fact that it's stuck right now, we're going to have an unstick attempt, uh, and it's going to be successful, but that only needs to happen one more time for this match to be done. <laughs> Ironically, and uh, Flo has tipped him in a worse position. Uh, yeah, this is, I don't think this is what Mirage wants. <laughs> but there you go, a little help from uh, Phenomenon gets them back on their wheels. That's going to count um, as a successful unstick. Hey, and it's a hey, full hey, self way right? back. But look at this. Whoa. The UHMW on the back of Mirage is so distorted that it's making it hard for those legs to yeah. grip the ground. They're still touching a little bit, but much less than they usually do, and that's significantly impacting the their front mobility. The armor package now oh, wow. gone on the front is left. Is that a lipo bag? It is. That is a strategy people take. They What better place to store your lipos than inside of a lipo bag? inside your armored I robot. I guess it can keep your robot from getting too smelly. Uh, let's see if it can protect it's against the weapon of Phenomenon. It's a bold strategy, Adam. Let's oh. see if it pays off for him. But I'm going to cover the tickle in that bag a little bit oh, with yeah, the weapon. It's just a little uh, oh. easy follow going on there. In a way, Brandon's being nice here, not going directly for the gaping hole of the bag of batteries. Instead, go around the side. It is peeling apart Mirage like it's a tin can from the 1920s. Mirage's armor has been holding up all day, but for not the power of Phenomenon is too much. Wow! wow. What Look a at that hit! And that there go the bag has been. What a hit! Completely. Look at the calm, cool, collected face of Brandon Bennett Young, taking Brandon. home a victory.